Hello, this is Ms. Morphew. I'd like to give you a fast story about a student who had a challenge using the research database and she communicated with a librarian. The librarian emailed her back and emailed me, tagged me in it so that I could understand that she wanted to uh, use better search terms. Here's the reply from the librarian. Hi, Anne. Thanks for getting in touch. We greatly appreciate you promoting the library to your students. Regarding ProCon database, it can be a great resource, but of course it's not comprehensive. So sometimes it just won't have what you need and you'll have to search elsewhere. In this particular case, it sounds like the underlying problem is that the student had difficulty coming up with the best search terms to use. In such situations, referring them to a librarian is the best bet, whether in person, by phone, email, or on the online chat. We are familiar with the subject headings used in different databases and can help students figure out related terms and synonyms to search on. For example, and then she listed where the student had been looking for welfare programs, public housing, food assistance, and SNAP, in order to do a persuasive speech on seeing uh, these federal programs as a positive hand up instead of just a hand out that, uh, that encouraged laziness or something because some people had that point of view. She wanted to persuade us to change our mindset and she now has a whole list of different examples that the search terms that could be used and the sources that she should use. So remember to contact your librarian if you're needing any different synonyms, different search terms, and you want to be effective in finding good sources.